I spent tens of minutes making that video. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No hard feelings, man. But I will not be bullied by that. Puny. All right, everybody. We are back in Flight Simulator 2020 in VR. Uh, we're going to do another fighter jet today. The uh, FA-18E Super Hornet. Not the regular Hornet, the Super Hornet. We'll go over the differences in a little bit. Uh, Blue Angels livery, and we're gonna do another twist. So let's do, let's do Cleveland like usual. Um, I like Gold and Dark starting this thing like everything else. And this one's actually really easy and quick to do. Um, let's go real time. And instead of the uh, insane thunderstorm like we did last time, we're gonna do, we're gonna see how Let's see how he handles strong winds, yeah? Okay guys, here we are in the Super Hornet. Uh, this is what it looks like. It's really cool. Um, aside from being bigger and faster, it really doesn't look all that much different. Uh, the, the dead giveaway and how you tell the difference on these guys versus the regular Hornet is those uh, intakes on the inlets there. Those are squared off and more angular, whereas on the regular Hornet they're uh, rounded out so that's the uh the biggest visible difference and the way the speed brake works but yeah that's uh that's the super hornet so let's go ahead and close this and get this thing fired up okay so as per usual uh like everything else master battery comes on get that apu fired up wait for the green light seriously though why do i still have that VFR map up. Okay, so APU is fired up. Um, next order of business, right engine first. Well, it sounds, see, those clouds look good. Definitely sounds windy. All right, engine one, right engine started. Let's do the lift. <laughs> All right, we're um we're started up. I think all that's left to do is finish our pre-flight Red Bull. And let's rock. The uh, other big difference in this plane is the tack on there is a touch screen on the Super Hornet versus an actual keypad on the uh, regular old thing. We definitely don't need that much runway, but we're gonna use it because it's fun. All right, we are lined up on that center line. Let's do a run up. We're gonna do mill power. Afterburner will come in a little bit. Let's see how strong this wind is, guys. Also, sadly, wow, okay, okay. Sadly, uh, Otto is not available to join us today. He's still got PTSD from the last video with the Concord. Oh, man. Oh, that's some wind. That's no, <laughs> all right. Look at how much it's pushing me. If I go full right rudder, I fly straight. Oh no. Excuse me, sir. Don't you even think about dumping chemtrails out, okay? I will hunt you down. 
Got it. FedEx. Oh, we got another guy to chase down. Either it, the wind's not bad up here, or I don't notice. The rain. What are you doing, sir? Flying circles around you, mate. This uh, little pinky switch on the F-18 stick is the uh, G-limiter override. Very handy tool. All right, I think we need to intercept this guy. Afterburner. Excuse me. Oh my lord. On your left. All right. Let's see what's going on at the lake. Go check out Cleveland in a thunderstorm. We'll go a little slower this time. That doesn't look good. There's a the rock hall, it looks a little messed up. Right. Oh! Let's see. Actively uh, lowering resolutions and whatnot. Alright. We gotta do it, guys. Alright, here we go. That's insane. Alright, give me Mach 1, baby. Oops. <laughs> okay, let's try that again, but this time we're just gonna start from the point. Alright, Pretty cool. That is amazing. Like a little, little cloud canyon. Man, I wish Otto were here to see this. And yeah, you saw a little bit about the scary landing in the back video, which you can probably check out up there somewhere. All right, so activities, custom content, turn to base. <laughs> this should hopefully be pretty cool, guys. So aside from the clouds being really blurry and grainy for some reason, that's pretty cool. Let's see how hard it is to fly in a hurricane. I will say the scale of this though is very cool. It's a shame the clouds look so bad. Oh! Like, why? You have the cloud data to work from. It's the game's clouds. This is from that same Adam so fly storm that I was talking about before. <laughs> the winds aren't even really doing anything. All right, let's go find a runway. And land in a hurricane. Boy, that looks like a runway to me. Alright, so the wind's pushing us a little bit to the left, but I don't. Not bad. It's not even raining. 
It's just, it's just dark. That was moderately terrifying. So, we're coming in kinda hot. Here's down. We got a little bit of wind, so crab. Crab for sure. Even if I did, it doesn't matter. It's too easy. I thought a hurricane would be like the biggest challenge. <sighs> well, that's going to do it for this one, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, comment, uh, dislike it if you hated it. Uh, yeah, no hard feelings, guy that left the comment on the other video. I was just making it silly. But uh, yeah, um, keep it lit, guys, and I will catch you in the next one.